And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Well, here comes our next round of rain coming up from the southwest. You see it out here in Missouri right now. This is going to overspread the area with time tonight. And some of this rain is going to mix with snow right here in our northwestern counties as temperatures continue to drop. So a little fog mist through the evening, and then spotty rain and drizzle develops. The wind picks up from the north northeast. We'll drop to 39 by 11, headed for 37 tonight. But again, as the rain comes in in our northwest, some snow mixing in too, and it will be blustery. Pretty strong northeast winds around 15 to 20, 25 miles an hour, and wind chills dropping into the 20s to right around 30 degrees. With lows tonight, 34 for Insulator, 37 Lafayette to 41 at Kokomo. Tomorrow's just a rainy day. Wind chills in the 30s, highs only around 43 degrees. Uh, varying from 40 in our northwest to about 46 in our southeastern counties. Even Thursday's a rainy day. Can't rule out a little isolated thunder. Wind chills in the 30s, but then temperatures start to fall. And by 5 p.m., it's 38. And some of the rain showers are beginning to mix with snow, with the winds really starting to crank up at that point. So highs anywhere from 38 to about 51 on Halloween and then falling. And speaking of trick or treating on Halloween, it looks pretty nasty out there. A scattering of rain and snow showers going to all scattered snow showers. Temperature falling to 32 by 9. Wind chills dropping to the upper teens to mid 20s, with some of these wind gusts exceeding 40 miles an hour at times. There's your rain coming in tonight. The peak, that's snow mixing in really from northwest Benton County through Newton, Jasper, and northwest Pulaski counties. And there's that heavy snow where a few places may get up to four inches here in north central Illinois. This is seven o'clock tomorrow morning. Raining at nine, it's raining at 10 30. Rain may become a little more showery towards evening, but still blustery. The rain intensifies again tomorrow night. More rain on Thursday, but notice what happens in the evening. The rain mixes with some snow. This is 630, and then a period of snow showers right during trick-or-treating time. And I wouldn't be a bit surprised if there are a few locations that see the grass whitened a little bit, maybe a few car tops here and there that have a little light slushy accumulation. So here are the higher winds coming in just in time for trick-or-treating. This is 8 o'clock. I think some of these gusts will exceed 40 miles an hour, but at the very least, getting gusts you know, 38, 39, 37 miles per hour, and a good solid one to two inches of rain expected from now right up to Thursday evening. Active forecast, 60s normal, way below normal, only 42 Friday after 27 in the morning. We cloud up Saturday, and we may get a few spotty rain and snow showers in the afternoon, and then we warm up. Hey, we're back into the low 60s Monday, Tuesday, and perhaps even some scattered showers and storms by Tuesday, Jeff. All right, nobody should dress up as Mary Poppins with an umbrella no. on, <laughs> on Thursday. Okay, thanks, okay. Jed. Uh,